अखंडमंडलाकार व्याप्त ये नाचराचर तत्पद दर्शि ये नस्म श्रीगुरव नम अज्ञानतिरांधस्जनशलाकया चक्षुन्मील ये न तस्म श्रीगुरव नम गुर्ब्रह्मा गुरु ओ महेश्वर गुरव परम ब्रह्म माता पिता बंधुष सखा विद्याद्रविणेवेवेवेव We start. Is it audible? Is it audible? No, not audible. No. Okay. Can you? Is it audible now? Little more louder. Is it okay now? श्री सद्गुरुनाथ महाराज की जय वी स्टार्ट द सत्संग बाय फर्स्ट ऑफरिंग अवर साष्टांग नमस्कार टू पूज्य स्वामी जी प्लीज डोंट थिंक टुडे इज the janmadina of our guru don't think like that because guru has no janma okay why chaitanya shashvatah shantah vyomatito niranjanah bintu nad kalatitah tasmai shri gurave namah to think that our guru has got janma is to not understand the guru guru has no janma no birth why because the guru is the chaitanya but we agnanis we who are in ignorance we can think that guru has janma but that is in agnana but we take every opportunity to find a way by which we can remember the guru offer our salutations to the guru gain more and more deep reverence and bhakti towards the guru so today we start our satsang invoking the grace of puji swami ji to bless us all with deep guru bhakti so that we all cross the ocean of samsara so that we all remain devoted dedicated to the guru so that we all live a life in accordance to the guru's teachings so this reaffirmment recommitment this guru bhakti is what we seek on this wonderful day and today's verse also is a very beautiful verse jnana shakti samarudha 
తత్వమాలా విభూషిత భుక్తి ముక్తి ప్రధాతా చ తస్మై శ్రీ గురవే నమ షల్ వీ రీడ్ టుగెదర్ జ్ఞానశక్తి సమారూఢ తత్వమాలా విభూషిత భుక్తి ముక్తి ప్రదాతా చ తస్మై శ్రీ గురవే నమ తస్మై శ్రీ గురవే నమ జ్ఞానశక్తి సమారూఢ వన్ హూస్ డీప్లీ ఫుల్లీ రూటెడ్ హూ అబైడ్స్ అండ్ హూ మేనిఫెస్ట్ ద జ్ఞానశక్తి ఆఫ్ భగవాన్ జ్ఞానశక్తి సమారూఢ భగవాన్ ఇస్ నోన్ ఫర్ త్రీ శక్తి జ్ఞానశక్తి ఇచ్ఛాశక్తి క్రియాశక్తి దీస్ ఆర్ ద త్రీ శక్తిస్ శక్తి మీన్స్ కెపాసిటీ శక్తి మీన్స్ ఎబిలిటీ శక్తి మీన్స్ దట్ ఎనార్మస్ వే టు మేక్ థింగ్స్ హ్యాపన్ వీ డోంట్ కాల్ శక్తి ఫర్ సింపుల్ మ్యాటర్స్ వి సే శక్తి ఫర్ అ లార్జర్ పర్పస్ ఇట్ నాట్ మై ఆడిబుల్ ఫర్ లార్జర్ పర్పస్ సో భగవాన్స్ జ్ఞానశక్తి హౌ ఇస్ భగవాన్స్ జ్ఞానశక్తి భగవాన్స్ జ్ఞానశక్తి ఈజ్ వన్ విచ్ నోస్ ఎవ్రీథింగ్ so we say bhagavan is sarvagnya and the upanishad would say bhagavan is sarvagnya and sarvavit yas sarvagnya sarvavit yas yajnanamayam tapaha so one who knows everything and one who knows everything in all detail so that knowing everything and knowing everything in detail so these two things are what is called as bhagavan's jnana shakti and what is bhagavan's ichcha shakti so kamayata bahusyam praja yeyeti that is how the upanishads describe bhagavan's ichcha shakti so bhagavan willed what did bhagavan will bahusyam may i become many so that's the one manifested as a variety that is a ichcha shakti and what is bhagavan's kriya shakti bhagavan's kriya shakti is making all that which is impossible also possible because bhagavan possesses that maya shakti and maya shakti is what agatita ghatana patiyasi that what is impossible it makes it possible and that shakti that maya is in bhagavan's possession so this is maya and bhagavan is what maya vi we say one who has this enormous capacity to make the impossible possible so that way the shastra describes the jnana shakti the ichcha shakti and the kriya shakti of bhagavan here what is said jnana shakti samarudha in guru you find the manifestation of bhagavan's jnana shakti జ్ఞానశక్తి సమారూఢ ఆరూఢ ఈస్ వాట్ ఆరూఢ ఈస్ వన్ హూ ఇస్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్డ్ సమారూఢ ఈస్ వాట్ వన్ హూ ఇస్ వెల్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్డ్ వన్ హూ ఇస్ వెల్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్డ్ ఇన్ జ్ఞాన జ్ఞాన ఆఫ్ వాట్ వన్ హూ ఇస్ వెల్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్డ్ ఇన్ దట్ నాలెడ్జ్ ఆఫ్ ద హయ్యెస్ట్ రియాలిటీ అండ్ వన్ హూ ఎనేబుల్స్ అ శిష్య ఆల్సో టు బికమ్ వెల్ ఎస్టాబ్లిష్డ్ ఇన్ దట్ జ్ఞాన 
Guru is like the lamp. So with the lamp, when you light some other lamp, what happens? The other lamp also shines. And that lamp's light does not get diminished. Jnana Shakti Samarudha. And then what? So when we say Jnana Shakti Samarudha, Guru is Bhagavan, but establishing himself deeply in that knowledge in which he is rooted, what does the Guru do? The Guru lifts the student. The Guru dispels the Ajnana of the Shishya. Guru enables the transformation of the Shishya. Shakti is required, no? Shakti is required. And the Guru has the Shakti to transform the student completely. To, to bring the student from Ajnana to Jnana. Asatoma Sadgamaya Tamasoma Jyotir Gamaya Murtyorma Amritam Gamaya The Guru does that. And that is why it is said here Jnana Shakti Samaruda. The Guru has no enmity with anyone. But the Guru's enmity is with Ajnana. Ajnana of the Shishya. The Guru dispels that. We know that verse which says, What is Guru? Right? Kukaras Chandakarohi. Gu stands for Andakara, doctors. Rukaraha Teja Vuchate. And Rukara is for light. Agnana Grasakam Brahma. What does the Guru do? Guru is that one, that Brahman, which eats up the Agnana. Agnana Grasakam Brahma. And this is a Guru. So Guru loves to eat the Shishya's Agnana. But does the Agnana touch the Guru? No. Because how can the sun be touched by darkness? In the presence of sun, darkness vanishes. In the presence of the Guru, Shishya's Agnana runs away, frightened. Jnana Shakti Samaruda. All right. Tattva Mala Vibhushitaha. And what is his ornament? He is adorned. Vibhushitaha, adorned. He is adorned with what? Tattva Mala. Swamiji, I know what is Rudraksha Mala. I know what is Suvarna Mala. Suvarna Mala is a garland of gold. I know what is what is Ratna Mala? Now here, what is the Guru wearing? Tattva Mala. Tattva Mala. Tattva is reality. Tattva Mala is, he wears a garland of reality. That reality is his garland. So what, what, what reality is his garland? Whether it is the Reality, when we say reality means what? Reality is Tattva, right? What is the Jiva Tattva? What is the reality of Jiva? What is the reality of Jagat? What is the reality of Ishvara? All that reality is shining in the persona of the Guru. Guru radiates reality. Like, like how a garland shines, no? Like, like how somebody wears a beautiful garland. So when you look at the person, you cannot miss that garland. Like that when the Guru, in Guru's presence, you cannot miss the reality. That reality shines. Tattva Mala Vibhushita. And Mala has got many beads. 
And the Guru always wants to gift that mala to the Shishya. And the Guru always finds out which tattva will work for the Guru, for the Shishya. Which tattva will work? For some Shishya, Tvampada will work. Tvampada is self, starting from self-knowledge. For some Shishya, Tattpada will work. So the Guru teaches for that student from Ishvara onwards. Whether from Jiva onwards or whether from Ishvara onwards. For some Shishya, Jagat works. So the Guru starts from the Tattva of Jagat. And that Mala, what Garland has got, has got many, many, many Tattva. Many, many Tattva. Dhrugdrishya Viveka. The Tattva of that. The methodology of that. Atma, Anatma Viveka. Discrimination, differentiation between self and not self. The Tattva. Panchakosha Viveka. Differentiation of the five sheets. Tattva from that. Karya, Karana Viveka. Differentiation of cause and effect, tattva coming from that. Like that, n number of tattvas, the Guru is adorned with all the tattvas of all the methodologies and that reality the Guru wears. So when you see the Guru, you cannot but remember all the methodologies of teaching that he adopts in order to help the seeker cross over the ocean of samsara. Tattva mala vibhushita. Right? And then what? Bhukti mukti pradhata cha. So you have bhukti and you have mukti. Bhukti, Bhukti is related to the world. Mukti, related to liberation. Bhukti, Mukti Pradhata. One who can bestow Bhukti and one who can bestow Mukti also. Guru can bestow Bhukti also. But all Tattva, Mala and all are related to Brahma Jnana, Brahma, related to that higher self-knowledge and you are saying Guru can bestow Bhukti also? Because Guru is that manifestation of Bhagavan, whatever the Shishya requires, the Guru blesses. If Bhukti is required for the Shishya to grow, Guru blesses Bhukti. If Mukti is required for the Shishya, immediately Guru blesses that also. Whatever Shishya requires, Guru will bless. Because Guru is a manifestation of Bhagavan for that Shishya. In the Mundaka Upanishad, there is a beautiful verse. It ends with Tasmad Atmagnyam Herchayed Bhuti Kamaha. Bhuti Kamaha, one Bhuti is what? Worldly things are called Bhuti. Bhuti Kamaha, Bhuti Kamaha is one who is desirous of Bhuti. You know, the Veda has got two sections, right? One is the Karma, another is the Jnana. Jnana bestows with Nishreyasa. Karma blesses, blesses one with Abhyudaya. Abhyudaya is worldly prosperity. And Nishtrayasa is what? Is a spiritual liberation. Is a realization. So, Bhukti is with respect to Abhyudaya. Mukti is with respect to Nishtrayasa. Bhukti, Mukti Pradhata. So the verses goes in Mundaka Upanishad very beautifully. Yam yam lokam manasa samvibhati vishuddha sattvaha kamayate yansha kamaan tam tam lokam jayate tansha kamaan 
ತಸ್ಮಾದ್ ಆತ್ಮಜ್ಞಂ ಹೆಚ್ಚೆಯೇತ್ ಭೂತಿ ಕಾಮ ಈವನ್ ಇಫ್ ಒನ್ ಈವನ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಈಸ್ ನೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಸೇಸ್ ಎಂ ಎಂ ಲೋಕಂ ಮನಸ ಸಂವಿಭಾತಿ ದ ಜ್ಞಾನಿ ಎಂ ಎಂ ಲೋಕಂ ವಾಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಬಿ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ವಾಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಬಿ ದ ರಲ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸಸ್ ವಿಶುದ್ಧ ಸತ್ವ he who is utterly pure at heart whatever wishes everything is there tam tam lokam jayate he gains attains all that worlds tansha kaman and the and whatever is a desirable there everything is there tasmad atmagnyam harchaye bhuti kamaha so that vishuddha sattva vishuddha sattva means what one who is utterly pure at heart whatever sankalpa comes to that jnani is automatically fulfilled whatever sankalpa the one who does not have sankalpa at all because of his utter oneness with the highest reality but for that shishya to benefit that shishya whatever sankalpa comes in that jnani's heart is fulfilled he who has no sankalpa for himself but for the sake of shishya knowing what is required for the shishya whatever he wishes that happens tasmad therefore atmagnyam herchayet worship that knower of the self who bhuti kamaha even who is desirous of something of the world worship him what to speak of those who seek nothing of the world and seek only the ultimate upasate purusham he hi akamaha those who worship him that jnani atmagnya akamaha desireless they are those people who worship desirelessly that high that jnani shukram etad ativartante dhira they are the dhira dhira they are the wise for them what happens they cross the ocean of samsara therefore bhukti mukti pradata cha one who gives bhukti and one who gives mukti so you must be careful what you ask the guru for you get mukti you get mukti you ask for mukti you get mukti you ask for mukti you get mukti the guru manifests what is required what is good for every shishya tasmad atmagnyam yarchayet worship that knower of that reality who desires not and we have seen in the presence of our gurudev the presence of pujya guruji the presence of pujya swami ji so many wonders of wonders keep on happening not because even they wish for it okay in their very presence because there you find the manifestation of the highest lord in their very presence because they themselves are what they themselves are sarvantaryamis they themselves are one with the totality therefore in their pure heart they themselves want nothing but in their pure heart when the shishya invokes everything happens automatically bhukti mukti pradata cha tasmai shri gurave namaha okay ಜ್ಞಾನ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಸೂಢ ತತ್ವಮಾಲಾ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ 
ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಧಾತಾ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಸ್ವಸ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಜಾಭ್ಯ ಪರಿಪಾಲಯಂತ ನ್ಯಾಯನ ಮಾರ್ಗೇಣ ಮಹಿಂ ಮಹಿಷಾ ಗೋಬ್ರಾಹ್ಮಣೇಭ್ಯ ಶುಭಮಸ್ತು ನಿತ್ಯಂ ಲೋಕಾಸಮಸ್ತ ಸುಖಿನೋಂತು ಕಾಲೇ ವರ್ಷತು ಪರ್ಜನ್ಯ ಪೃಥಿವೀ ಸಾಲಿ ದೇಶೋ ಎಂ ಕ್ಷೋಭರಹಿ ಬ್ರಾಹ್ಮಣ ಸಂತು ನಿರ್ಭಯ ಶಾಂತಿರ್ಣ ಮಂಗಲ ಸುಖಿ ಸಂತು ನಿರಾಮಯ ಭದ್ರಿ ಪಶ್ಯಂತು ಮಾ ಕಶ್ಚಿದ್ದುಖಾಗ್ಭೇತ್ ಅಸತೋ ಮಾ ಸದ್ಗಮಯ ತಮಸೋ ಮಾ ಜ್ಯೋತಿರ್ಗಮಯ ಮೃತ್ಯೋರ್ಮಾ ಅಮೃತಂಗಮಯ ಓಂ ಪೂರ್ಣಮದ ಪೂರ್ಣಕೂರ್ಣಮುದಚ್ಯತೆ ಪೂರ್ಣಸ್ಯೂರ್ಣಮಾದಾಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮೇವಶಿಷ್ಯತೆ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಹರಿ ಓಂ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಓಂ ಹರ ಹರ ನಮ ಪಾರ್ವತೀ ಪತೇ ಹರ ಮಹಾದೇವ ಸರ್ವತ್ರ ಗೋವಿಂದ ನಾಮ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನ ಗೋವಿಂದ ಗೋವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಸದ್ಗುರುನಾಥ ಮಹಾರಾಜ ಕೀ ಜೈ